What is up guys, we're back in another video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to create good thumbnails for your YouTube videos. So what you're going to want to do is search up Pixlr.com Now Pixlr.com you can make thumbnails, you can make channel art, you can make many many things on it. So what you're going to want to do when you get to Pixlr is you're going to want to click open Pixlr editor. Um, right here it says ad blocker detected, just click cancel, it doesn't really matter. Now click create new image. Um, go to, okay, so make the width 1280 and make the height 720. So it's 1280 by 720. Then you're going to want to go to this little transparent box right here and check it. So you have this. This should be what your screen should look like. So click, okay. Now, I have this checkerboard pattern on my thing. So what you're going to want to do once you do this is you're going to want to make a good background so what you're going to want to do is click new tab and then search up like a background you want like um let's say um dark background dark background so if i search up dark background go to images there's going to be some like darkish backgrounds and like some dark backgrounds so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to search dark background um, dark background, and then you're going to want to do 1280 by 720, so that the thing knows that the size has to be 1280 by 720, so these are like 1280 by 720s, so I'm actually not going to be using one of these backgrounds, I'm going to be using a, um, galaxy background, or, um, yeah, uh, so, galaxy background, 720, I mean 1280 by 720, 1280 by 720, so, why I accidentally did that little line right there, so, um, there's gonna be some backgrounds that pop up, um, the one that I'm going to do is 1280, 720, I'm gonna do this one, so, click save image as, then this screen should pop up, click save, Wait, actually, what you're going to actually want to do instead is, here, redo this. Go to, and then click the image. Click the image. Go on to it, and then click the image. So, what you're going to want to do when you click the image is then you're going to want to save image as. So, it knows that it wants the 1280 by 720 image. Click save, and then go to online pixeler. Go to file, open image, and colorful galaxy digital art DVD. And then this should happen. So I know this looks kind of ugly. You can see some of this stuff. So what you're going to want to do is click Control A, C T R L A, basically. And then it'll say Select All. Then Control C. And then you're going to want to click part of the checker pattern, and then your picture will disappear. So what you're going to want to do is click Control V, and there you go. You have your background. So now what you're going to want to do, if you want to put images and stuff, um, on it, you're going to want to do, like, for example, let's see, um, a YouTube sign, YouTube, YouTube picture, and then click transparent, or else this won't work, so YouTube picture, and it has to be transparent, so, um, I'm just gonna pick a random one, I guess I'll do that one, it doesn't matter what size it is, just save image as and yeah click save and then go to online pixlr go okay so this kind of can get a little confusing you're going to do the same thing you did um to get the background so click open and then here you have it you have this picture it looks ugly on your thing so click control a to select all and you'll see like these little lines moving across control c to copy or it didn't work. Control C. Okay, there we go. And then tap anywhere else and then click Control V. But it turns it, it like this one wasn't. No. Okay. But this this YouTube picture was not transparent for some reason. It didn't work to be transparent. Well, just just try to find in images that are transparent. Um, I don't know why that didn't work. That's interesting. It looks transparent to me. Um, I'm going to try to find a different transparent one. Here, let's see. Um, maybe 
maybe, maybe, maybe. Um, here, give me a second, and I will be back showing you the um, a transparent image. All right, guys. So we found a transparent um YouTube logo image. So just you were, I was doing it right. I just that just wasn't transparent. I guess so I just tried to find a transparent one. So um now what we're going to try to do is we're going to be typing typing something. So um um the some fonts are just so horrible, just bad, straight, plain, horrible, just just no good font. Um, uh, like, like, you need to, um, so you'll only start with three fonts if you don't go to a website called defont.com. So go to defont.com to find some fonts. Um, pick which fonts you want, click download. You can search fonts and stuff, but, um, I can't go to it because I already did the stuff I wanted to. So, um, my favorite font personally is this one. The, um, the, um, where is it, where is it, where is it? So, these are the ones that you will start with. Those are the fonts you'll start with. So, um, you're going to want to go to... So, my favorite font is Arial Black. Um, so, the size I'm going to want to do is 100. So, I'm going to do how, enter, space, 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 two, eh, and I want to center that, two, enter, make, good, YouTube thumbnails. Okay, and then click OK. And now you can do the move tool to move the items that you want to move. Now, this got a little bit too big, so I'm going to have to. So I'm just going to do how to make good. How to make good YouTube thumbnails. So, um, what? So, I have this so far, um, since it kind of got ruined. So, you're going to want to go down here. Um, and then I'm going to type th thumbnails. I'm going to make it. I'm going to click. I'm going to make. Oh my, that's solo down. All right, I'll click enter. Can't really like see my. Okay, oh, I have an idea. Um, delete this all. All right, just click off. I'm gonna click off of the type tool, and then I'm going to type it up here. Thumbnails. Thumbnails. Okay, and then I'm going to resize this to like um. 80 maybe so it's not so big click okay and i'm gonna get the move tool i'm going to move that down here and yeah um now i'm going to do all right guys so i'm going to show you guys a good um oh sorry i was watching that video because i was confused why it wasn't transparent so i'm going to now do um i so View I transparent view I. So yeah, these are the this is a view I. It looks like um that. So you're gonna want to click on it first to make sure this one is not transparent. Is this one transparent? Yes, this one. No, that's not transparent. Um. Oh shoot! No. no blah, blah. I don't want to do that. All right, guys. So basically, that is just how you need to, how to make a thumbnail. You can just keep doing this if you want. So I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see in the next video.